Hi. Uh, good afternoon, I guess it is now. I'm here with Stephen Miles, and we're at Dell Tech at the uh, Department of Commerce event. And uh, tell us something about your company. Uh, well, Analtech has been manufacturing a very niche product for analytical chemists uh, called thin layer chromatography plates for 50 years now in Delaware. And um, we're here to share our experience with exporting because um, I think there's a lot of small businesses that are afraid to jump into that. It's a black mm. box. They just don't know what to expect. And um, we experienced that very same thing, 1995, zero exports. And we kind of started dipping our foot into it very early on without any help. Um, so we did it the wrong way. I'm here to tell everybody how to do it the right way by talking to the World Trade Center of Delaware, by using the state of Delaware's International Trade Division and the U.S. Department of Commerce. I mean, all those tools are so helpful. Basically, for two years, we did didn't use those. We didn't know they were there. We kind of floundered. Um, right. After that, we started really doing How well. did you discover all these resources? Um, well, 1995, when we launched our first website and started going a little more international, um, it was kind of the dawn of searching on the internet. Um, we did have some people starting to knock on our door. The World Trade Center did that uh, within a year or so. Started inter uh, in, um, saying, uh, would you like to come to a seminar on how to export? And that's great, the ABCs of exporting. Um, we learned from that. I actually went to that a couple times. Right. Um, missed uh, some the first time, but you really uh, need to ingrain yourself in the basics and then do it, fail a little bit, try it again. Um, it's a learning and process. We started talking to the World Trade Center more and more, and um, the resources we found online were our products were exporting them. Now we need to learn something called harmonized codes. That's a code that uh, internationally is recognized for what your product is so that somebody overseas doesn't have to read it. They see a number and they know what it is. Right. So the U.S. Department of Commerce has a great, has always had a great website with a list of harmonized codes and how to find your product on there. Right. And how to get your product then classified so that right. your potential markets can find you. Exactly. Okay, so what brings you to the conference today? Well, uh, I was invited. Uh, we had a relationship again with the World Trade Center of Delaware, and uh, we were contacted probably through a couple of sources that pointed to us saying, hey, Delaware has done pretty well with their growth over the last 15 years. They used to be zero international, now they're 25% international sales. So basically, we had an invitation, I had a uh, uh, conference call over the phone with a few people from the uh, Department of Commerce, and after that call they said, hey, great experience, let's, let's have you on the, on the panel. All right, well thank you very much.